Hey everybody. Hey Carrie. I'm going to um, give it a few minutes and let um, some people join in. Hey Denise. I have my box on the table, on my craft table. Um, it's too big for the camera view and I have already opened it. I could not wait. I've had it sitting here for a day. I got it yesterday, so I um, had to open it. I've organized it a little bit, so um, hopefully it um, will not take so long to show you. But um, I am a, a demonstrator for a company called Stampin' Up! And um, Stampin' Up! is a company where you can make paper crafts and I absolutely love it. Um, my upline uh, Denise is in the house with us. Uh, she is another amazing uh, card maker and we sometimes get together and craft but um, this year's holiday catalog was absolutely amazing and there was a lot of things in there that I didn't get but there was a lot of things in there I did get. Um, so I wanted to share everyone, uh, like I said in my preview post, this is probably the biggest order that I have ever ordered from Stampin' Up! And I just wanted to share it with you. So I'm going to uh, move my box off my craft table and we'll get started. So uh, the first thing that was in the box is they sent me a preview of the Paper Pumpkin. Um, paper Pumpkin is a good way to start if you um, are thinking about doing some um, crafting, paper card making. Paper Pumpkin is a good way um, to start off it's a monthly subscription it's uh, twenty two dollars a month you can do it month by month there's no uh, it's like you don't have to do it for three months and then be able to cancel you can cancel it at any time um, I did get my add-on they had a special add-on for this month's paper pumpkin and I, I got it uh, today even before I got my paper pumpkin so I look forward to sharing a video on that um, so it did give me uh, a little flyer about this uh, upcoming month's paper pumpkin and this is the glorious catalog we cannot show you the inside we can only show you the cover it does not go live until um, September the 4th for um, people to order from. But they do allow us to show you what we have purchased. Um, they do sh allow us to show you um, cards and, and paper crafts that we make with what we've purchased and I'll tell you right off the bat the two pictures that are on the catalog I ordered almost everything that you see here so I'll hold this up a little bit closer to the camera this first set is Cardinals the second set is Snowman and they are absolutely the cutest thing that I have ever seen. I think the snowman is my absolutely favorite. Uh, then there's another one um, that is in here and then the Cardinals is my third. So let me see what's on top. I think the snowman stuff's on top so let me 
flip through the catalog and get to the snowman so I can tell you exactly what the um, name of the products are. This is called Let It Snow Sweet. And the stamp set in this suite, there you can order this separately. This is a bundle. It's a snowman season, and you have the, your stamp set. And look at these cute little snowmen. They are adorable. And you can color them. You can punch them out. And um, after you stamp them, you can punch them out. This is the punch. And it's the um, snowman builder punch. So you can punch your snowman out and uh, punch a hat out. It's got a carrot for his nose and um, his little arms. So that's the um, punch. And it's pretty easy to use for those of you who haven't stamped before. You just put your card stock in and you just punch it and it punches out this design and then to, to store it it just locks back in place and you can um, store it flat so here's the stamp set and it is what they call photopolymer and it comes with another set called tiny keepsakes and we've got the very popular buffalo check right now and this kind of reminds me of uh, candy cane stripes and it is what we call clean mount and um, it's red rubber and it just sticks to your um, stamping block and you stamp the um, this set comes with some dies and what I like about these dies is this comes with um, a little treat box that you can make and they are called mini curvy keepsake box dies and I'll show the catalog front in just a second because it does show a picture of them and you run these through a die cutting machine there's several die cut machines on the market there's what they call the Sizzix Big Shot, there's a Cuddlebug, there's um, a Gemini, there's several but this big die here makes a little treat box and you just cut it um, in your die machine and I'll see if I can hold this up give me a minute till the um, there's a lag on Facebook and I'll point to whenever it shows up in my camera view I'll point to the box that it makes it's right here that makes that little box and the little tags that go with it so that's that one and it also come with an embossing folder and this one's called winter knit and what it does is you um, put a piece of cardstock in it run it through your die cutter and it embosses your cardstock and makes it texturized and this one looks like to me like a, a winter sweater type thing. Let me see if I can find a piece of hard stock right quick to show you what it looks like on the inside. See if you can see that detail right there. It makes this design on your cardstock. 
And then this thing right here, I absolutely fell in love with. This is probably the main reason why I bought this whole set, that and the snowman stamp set. This is the Let It Snow embellishing embellishment kit. And it comes in this cute little box, which can hold cards if you want to give cards as a set. But look at this. Isn't this adorable? So you can um, stamp your snowman out and add his little arms, a little carrot for the nose, and they're 3D. So they're like little stickers, but they're 3D. You can, you can, they have, you can feel them. And then we've got little coal for the buttons and little coal for the eyes. There's some little snowballs that you can add. And some glittery washi tape. And these little felt embellishments you get four different colors. I think that is um, Coastal Cabana, uh, Garden Green, maybe and real red but what they are are just little felt embellishments there's a um, a hat there's a scarf you can put on them there are little mittens here's the little mitten I think that's it mittens hat and a scarf but these also are going to add just a little bit of dimension to your um, cards so that's the embellishment kit and then there's uh, some ribbon that's in this suite I know um, Denise loves ribbon this one is adorable we can find the end I never can find the ends on these but there's the ribbon that goes with that sweet and it is called real red curly ribbon then we have um, actually I think this ice glitter goes with something else so we'll hold the phone on that one uh, hold please it also comes with some snowfall accent puff paint it's down in this box somewhere so we'll get back to that so this is the snowman season or let it snow sweet oh there's the there's the puff paint that goes with that one all right let's see what else we got in this box we've got not before Christmas memories and more kit and these are just um, pre-made um, cards and envelopes. So if you didn't want to get full-fledged in your card making, so here is already a card and you just have to decorate it and the envelope. And I love these because they looked really um, traditional Christmas. The next suite is frosted foliage or foliage. Let me turn to it in my catalog so I can tell you exactly what these are called and this is the feels like frost suite so our stamp set is 
frosted foliage and it is a clean mount stamp set and it's got snowflakes real pretty um, fonts and the frosted flame frames um, framelits that go with it are here and they cut out some real pretty fr frames and there's some snowflakes so that is the frosted fr frames dies and the ribbon is this gorgeous seaside spray metallic ribbon and let me get it going so you can see how pretty it is there you go so that is Seaside Spray Metallic Ribbon. The Ice Stamping Glitter goes with this set. The um, Shimmer, Shimmery Crystal Effects. Can't wait to play with this and show you how that works. And last but not least, we've got this gorgeous paper. It is unbelievable. One side is picturesque snow scenes, and the other side is a metallic. And I think you get four sheets of each. So there's the one side of that one. And then we've got this winter scene with um, some more silver um, on the other side. This looks like a pine cone with um, snow, and that's the back side. Ice sickles on a tree, and that's on the back side. Then we've got snow on um, some pine trees, and that's the back side. That's the back side of that one. Gorgeous paper. It's going to be hard to decide which side to. Um, use. And it just goes on and on. There's just so many designs. That one's just absolutely beautiful. And then that's the back side. So that is the Feels Like Frost uh, designer series paper and that is the whole suite of Feels Like Frost and there's the stamp set Frosted Foliage I think this is my next favorite suite in the catalog and let me find it for you so I can tell you the correct names hold please 
brightly gleaming um, sweet. And here's the stamp set. Um, Christmas gleaming stamp set. Sorry, I thought we were frozen there for a minute. And it is um, cling mount on red rubber. And there was another set that wasn't in the suite. But what you do is you stamp these um, baubles. And it comes with a punch pack. So it will punch out those two um, images. Let me see if I can find that other stamp set. The other stamp set was Memories of Home and I, I purchased it because it will the punch pack will also punch out these um, stamped images. So you've got your stamp set You've got your punches that go with the stamp set. Um, you've got another embossing folder, and this one's called Hammered Metal. And it kind of makes it look like a, that someone has um, hammered and made dents in metal. And it, it texturizes cardstock. It has um, this... Merry Christmas ribbon and it is a uh, ribbon that's on what they the color they call a uh, very vanilla and um, it's called classic weave um, ribbon and it is copper this this uh, stamp suite is um, copper color based. If I can get in it, I will show you this ribbon. There it is. And it has Merry Christmas in different fonts stamped on it. Then we have some star designer elements. These are adhesive backed. You just take them off the sticker sheet and just stick them on whatever it is project that you're making. And then we've got the brightly gleaming full accents. And you get several sheets. I think there's one, two, three, four, five sheets and these are copper die cuts. There's a star, a bobble, and a leaf pattern and another couple of small stars on, the, on those sheets. Then we have the designer series paper And it is called Brightly Gleaming Specialty Designer Series Paper. And they, when they do um, special things to the paper, it's not Designer Series Paper. It's uh, Designer Series Special Paper. And that's because it's got the copper on one side and then the um, plain design on the other. So you get two sheets of this one. I think this one is my favorite. That's the front and that's the back. Front, I love that one too. And the back. I love these colors. That's the front. That's the back. Then you've got some green. And then that's the back. 
So this is the brightly green, gleaming designer series paper. And I forgot to show you all the snowman paper whenever I come to it in the box. I'll show it to you. It's really cute. So that was the brightly gleaming um, sweet. And now we have the cardinal set. It is Hey Juanita, Tool Tiding Suite. And I think this is one of the suites that I almost got everything, but not quite. So the um, stamp set is the Toil Christmas, and it is red rubber, clean mount, so when you take the stickers off, they will stick to your block really well. And then the framelits, or the dies, they've stopped calling them framelits, the dies go with this set so you can stamp the cardinal and then you just take the die and run it through your die cutting machine and it will cut out the cardinal then there's one for the banner and there's one for the other banner there's um, one for the um, leaf and berry embellishment. I think this stamp set is, is a little small for the actual size that the picture is. And then these swirls, there's some swirls that you can cut out. So that's the stamp set and the framelits. And these yummy embellishments right here called Tool Tidings Glimmer Enamel Dots. And they are in garden green and real red, very traditional colors. And then we have um, garden green double stitched ribbon and there, there is 10 yards of this ribbon. And then there is the real red ruched ribbon. Another 10 yards on this spool. And it is a one inch in diameter. Isn't that pretty? I love traditional Christmas colors. The other stamp set, um, called tidings all around and there was another framelits that you can make frames um, I didn't get that one in this order but I liked um, this frame I got this one free because I had um, spent over $150 so I picked out one for free I really liked this uh, stamp set here because it has the little acorns and I am addicted to acorns I love anything that has acorns so it is a photo polymer set. So that was something in the catalog that coordinated with this uh, set. So I got it. And we'll take a look at the paper. And this is uh, in, um, it's called Tool Tidings designer series paper and the co the colors that coordinate with this are real red and garden green
and it has a front side and a back side. And you get two sheets of each design. So there's the front and the backs, and it's on very vanilla, real red, garden green. Then you've got the buffalo check. That's the front and the back. Or this A side, B side. And then it repeats itself in, in red. A side, B side. And this one I love. We've got a um, fox, a bear, a rabbit, a deer. There's a bird. Love this one. And then there's the red side. These are going to be lots of fun to make some cards with. I can't wait to, to do that cardinal. So that is the Toil Tidings suite, or some of it. I, like I said, I didn't get all of it. And this one was a stamp set um, on its own, and it's called Everything Festive. So you've got Halloween covered, you've got Christmas covered, you've got Valentine's, um, New Year's. So, and I love the fonts in that one. And it is also clean mount. And they're pretty big stamps. So they'll make good, bold images on the front or the inside of your card. This is another stamp set that was that's by itself called Snowfront. And any of these that you see if you will pin, just pin, uh, search them on Pinterest, you would not believe some of the things that they are doing with this stamp set. It is like a watercolor look. It is really pretty. So we've got a little snowman down here in the corner, a house, mountains, a stream, birds, just absolutely pretty. And you could do this uh, tree and make this these dots fall color and make a fall scene a winter scene you could change it up and do green and make a, a summer scene or do pinks and make it like look like a cherry tree for spring scene so you could use this one not just for Christmas but this is a good stamp set to use uh, for every season The next one we have is called So Many Stars, and it has a stamp set and framelits that match. And look at all these stamps you get in this stamp set. They are um, photopolymer. I love the greetings um, and the sayings of the greetings. But what I really liked about this stamp set is it has framelits um, that are what we call stitched dies, and they're stars. And we'll open these up. And they're called what we call nesting stars. So it will when you cut it on your die machine it will um, make them appear to be stitched and then they nestle inside each other so you can do different sizes and again Pinterest this one this one is unbelievable you these stars have centers that you can build and make a 3D star out of so that one is called so many stars And this one is another, I love punches. I'll buy, because the punches are so easy to use, I will buy most of the stamp sets that have um, the punches. 
This is called wrapped in plaid and you can stamp your trees and cut them out or you can cut your tree out of this designer series paper and it is also a photo polymer stamp set and that's the punch and there are a lot of sheets in here 48 sheets you get for $14.50 so you get one two three four sheets of each design there's the A side there's the B side and I don't know if you can see that but there's some gold accents there's the front side and I love it I love that plaid and it has some gold this has deer and there is the back side we've got dots and a, this very traditional color I seen this someone else showing it but in person it's just unbelievable um, you can use your punch to punch out um, the tree on this particular paper which I will show you I think yep and you just I'm not going to punch it but I'm going to show you how it works you can punch out your trees from this paper and it puts a nice pretty white border all the way around and then you just latch it back for flat storage and then there's the back side Turn that one around. It's too dear. This one's really pretty. It almost looks like it's not of navy, like a dark blue. So let's surprise ourselves and see what's on the back side. Yep, there's some blue in there. Like I said, I wasn't crazy about this paper until I opened this pack and looked at it love that one and then there's that one so that is the wrapped in plaid paper and it is six by six per, uh, wrapped in plaid sweet And the last set I got is the Harvest Hellos. You stamp the, a the apple or it makes a pumpkin. I really liked the pumpkin. Back to school teacher gifts you could do. Um, you can do, um, if you send out Thanksgiving cards, you could do a harvest card trying to find it so I can tell you it's probably just the harvest hellos but there's a, a couple of sets that this goes with not just this set but um, harvest hellos and this is the apple builder punch so what you do is you stamp your apple or you stamp your pumpkin and it will cut out the leaves and the stem and what you do is for the apple this is uh, the top of the stem and then for your pumpkin the, you just flip it around and this is the top of your pumpkin stem pretty neat so that is Harvest Hellos 
and I forgot to show you the paper that goes with the snowman suite. And I'm not going to open the glitter red because it's just red glitter. And it is real red glimmer paper and there you get two sheets in this one. But this is the Snowman Let It Snow Specialty Designer Series paper. And like I said before, when it's um, specialty paper, it'll have some um, texture or it will be in some kind of uh, metallic foil. So here is the glorious page of Snowman's absolutely adorable this is my favorite set I am so in love with this set and this is the back side you get two sheets of it then we have a page of mittens on the back side is that and the colors that coordinate with this set, let me look at it for you and tell you. I know it's Coastal Cabana. I do know that. Coastal Cabana, Basic Black, Flirty Flamingo, um, Real Red, Shaded Spruce, and there is a blue, which is probably Balmy Blue and the Blueberry Bushel. And there's that back side. And this is the one that is the specialty paper. There's, I'll kind of do it like this so you can see there, it's little rays that has a little bit of texture and a little bit of um, glitter to it and then there's the back side cut the bright off a little bit see if y'all can see that a little bit better and then we've got some trees and there's the back side and we've got some hats and there's the back side some snowflakes that is really pretty and then some more snow snowman and there's the back side but what i liked about this set is you take your punch and I have to trim some off the bottom to get it all the way up but these snowmen or snowmen or snow women or snow person you can punch them out with your punch so that is another idea so yeah there you go. That is my biggest order that I have ever placed with Stampin' Up! because, and I'm not done, there's there's still more that I want to purchase, but I have to let my pocketbook catch up with me before I can place another order. So, if you are watching this after the replay, just do hashtag replay. If you are interested in joining um, Stampin' Up, you can comment um, join and I will be in touch with you on how to join. If you're interested in the Paper Pumpkin, which is the um, monthly subscription box, um, just comment PP for Paper Pumpkin and I will it get in touch with you on the details just um, watch my if you're local and you um, like stamping with Kathy and I, I do hold some classes if you are interested in, in joining me and a couple of ladies 
and learn how to make uh, your own cards, I'd be glad to show you. I appreciate y'all spending some time with me tonight, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your night.